Hello, this is Karen Somberg of Howling Moose Gardens. This is my first video regarding Howling Moose Gardens, the greenhouse. So, here's the loading dock. And over there is the work shed. And over there, behind the porta potty, is the foam cellar. Some foam for rafts. So I've come in from the loading dock. And here I am with my little corner AP system that I'm using to get gravel going while everything else gets built, gravel and bacteria. So, as you can see, I have a bunch of IBCs. The big lump down there is the liner for the trough, and I have some 100-gallon stock tanks to act as deep gravel beds. So I've just come out of the loading dock, and I'm in now what is called the, the short house. This is a greenhouse made out of polycarbonate. And if I go from the loading dock and go left, there's a little walkway down here into the root cellar slash bulb shed. Nice dark hole for you. And I'll be renting some of that to use for short-term storage because it's nice and cool. The previous tenants are still here, just a little bit. They should be out within the next day, if not a few hours. So I'm walking along the, sh the short house into the main head house. This is the central core of the setup. So I'm facing north right now. If I turn and look south, that's the machine shed that I mentioned at the very beginning of the video. There are five 100 foot by 25 or 30 foot side houses here. This is one of the ones that I'll be renting. Going down the head house to another one of those. So as you can see this one's nice and empty and ready to go. And then there are two more on that side. So there's a central walkway and then there are two dirts on, on each side. So on each of these, I'm going to put a four foot wide trough, two of them parallel on each side of the concrete. And the troughs will go down one side and come back up the next. A fish tank on one side and a sump tank on the other. So since I'll be using rafts, I'll be able to plant on that end. I'll be able to plant on the far side and I'll be able to harvest on this side. So that'll cut down on my walking and maintenance and things like that. Um, there is a pretty good setup for heat and cooling. There's the end uh, fan, as you can see. There are some uh, sensors and what have you. This is all hooked into a, an alarm, so my cell phone will beat me if the temperature gets outrageously high or outrageously low. It's a double-walled polyfilm greenhouse, so these nice uh, I like to call them hair dryers, but obviously that's not what they are. That this, this keeps the, the two layers of plastic inflated, and so you get, you know, four to six inches worth of air as, as insulation. There's gas heat. And then out the back, in this not quite closed door, is a pretty big field with lots of fun materials to play with. There's a broken down shed over here, which they keep a bunch of stuff in. And then over to the left, over to the west, there's an 8-acre field that I'm hoping to find someone to share crop with. The things sticking out are the water uh, drain, so I hope to put some water tubs underneath there to save some of my rain water. So that's my first uh, video. Hopefully it worked. I'll go home and edit it tonight and see if I can post it up later. Thanks for watching. Bye.